That's really cool. <laughs> so we've been to Duty Free, we've um, got ourselves all perfumed up, Swarovski Crystal Lip Balm, <laughs> and we're ready for the off. So speak to you, see you later. Bye! Bye! <laughs> <laughs> Well, um, it's day one in Kathmandu and oh my, it's absolutely insane. You've seen the images, you've seen the pictures, but 
it's real. We got off the plane and it was just lovely, you know, kind of nice fresh air and everything. And then we got on the bus to transfer to the hotel and it's insane. And it gets dusty and there's just people everywhere. There's cows in the road. We've seen one guy walking down the road with a wardrobe on his head and back. He literally had it kind of strapped on his head and on his back. It was hilarious. Um, motorcycles with kids on, uh, carrying glass doors. It, it, it's just bonkers. So um, I've done a little video clip so hopefully you'll be able to get a feel for it. I don't think it will show in its true entirety. But yeah, the smells as well. It all just adds to the general feel of it. And we are now in our three-star hotel, which um, the lamps don't have light bulbs in. Um, and some of the light fittings don't all work. It's a little bit dodgy, to say the least. <laughs> but we've had a nice evening meal. We, we got here quite late because of the transfer and the traffic and bits and bobs. But... Um, they literally chucked our bags on top of the bus as well. Hilarious. So we got in, quick shower, then we had something to eat and we had a meeting um, to discuss plans and bits and bobs for what we're doing starting tomorrow. Hard work starts tomorrow. And um, yeah, that went on for a little while and we've basically been back in the room packing, unpacking, repacking, ready for our flight to Luckler tomorrow and then the commencement of our... Um, first trek day so uh, I'll speak to you and let you know how we get on. Bye! Mwah. Hi! <laughs> so we're still at um, the airport at the moment waiting to fly out to Lucknow because it was shut this morning and a bunch of tourists have got ahead of us so it's going to be another hour or so before we go. We're going to get there about between 9 or 10. So as soon as I get there, I'll give you a ring. <laughs> I know you'll know that before you see this but it doesn't matter. Um, flight actually is not worrying me. Apparently it's going to be great so we'll see a rest and everything. Um, but I'm scared about the wall, so we good to get started. I think everybody wants to get started, so I'll let you know how we get on later. Bye! Is fantastic we've all achieved it um, we flew into Luckla Airport today which was an experience <laughs> to say the least <coughs> excuse me um, I think we flew in around 2,800 meters and so we've done a day's trekking like I say but we're actually at 2,652 meters right now we've been down we've been up we've been down we've been up it's just been our oh, views are amazing very dodgy bridges over big like 
drops in rivers underneath. The river is flowing like blue milk. It's oh, it's just absolutely stunning. Um, all the Nepalese people are, you know, really polite, really nice. And oh my, they're really tiny, but don't ever judge their strength. <laughs> they got these like straps around their heads and the things they carry on their backs, carrying all our bags for us and everything. It's absolutely bonkers. All the big, you know, sort of tents and bits and bobs that they go ahead and set up for us and the catering. So um, we've had two guys come down with altitude sickness already, which is a bit of a worry. Um, headaches and feeling sick so fingers crossed that you know we're not all going to get struck with that but it's just one of those things that you just don't know so we're drinking loads peeing loads <laughs> and we're about to go over some dinner it's bloody cold <laughs> because it's been snowing <laughs> can't wait to wake up in the morning see what the views are like because um it doesn't normally it rain in me. snow in november um but we've had snow today so um it's been it's been really cool because it's not been too much but I think it could be a bit of a drag if we have you know it goes on for too many days so we'll let you know how tomorrow goes see you later bye Mwah.